Hello Taurus, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. We have trust the universe. Now this is trusting in the spiritual path, trusting in spirit, trusting that everything is going to work out for your higher good and spirit know best here. The universe knows best. Seven of Earth. Now this is equivalent to the Seven of Pentacles in the traditional tarot deck. Seeds well planted, a temporary pause in action, unnecessary worry. Okay, so the seven of pentacles here, unnecessary worry. What happens here is as well that if you've got patience, things start to grow, but it takes patience and time. So it can mean here that this patience is needed. And if you work hard, remember the universe will always reward you for what you put into things, you'll get out of it. So let's have a look and see what the guidance is. If this starts to resonate, please like, share and subscribe. You've done the work, you've planted the stable foundations for the future, so trust that things will progress when the time is right. The Page of Wands, the beautiful Temperance card, which is Sagittarius energy, the Two of Swords, the Ace of Pentacles, the overall central energy is the Five of Pentacles, Six of Swords, the beautiful Star card, which is healing energy, Aquarius energy, the beautiful Empress, and the Page of Pentacles. Now we've got the overall central energy here is feeling that your half cu your cup's half full instead of half empty. So there is disappointment here. You're feeling disappointed, left out in the cold. You might even feel abandoned. There's healing here. There's hope, new hope and rejuvenation coming in. You've started this goal here. You've went down your inspired path. You're going to obviously have the intuition here to be able to, and the knowledge and the wisdom. Uh, this can be uh, the start of ideas uh, to move things on here. Whatever you're going through, you're going to get over this. This is about focusing on what you've already achieved and not what you're not achieving at this moment in time. You've already built something really good, something very solid, but you're disappointed about the progress it's making. You, you are on the right path. You're going to heal from any upsets. You're going to be able to move on from this. So just focusing purely and simply on what you've achieved up till now. Because this was a new opportunity that's going to bring stability in, but it does take work. So it could be new jobs we're talking about, new courses. It could be new places to live. Anything to do with contracts or finances. You're, you've took up these opportunities. You were passionate about them. There's a bit of disappointment here about the progress of things. But you've done the planning. You've laid the solid foundations and you're going to get over this. You will get over this, definitely. Now, it might be difficult here. You might have to resolve issues you might have to go back to the drawing board here to bring the stability back you might have to gather information that's going to help you with the decisions that need to be made but don't wallow in the disappointments look look at your situation it will be very difficult to see the way forward if you focus on the negatives so we really have to turn that around like i say fives are change so what we need to be doing is focusing on what we've achieved Listen to your intuition here like you've done up till now. You might, like I say, this could be study that's connected to study or new jobs, anything new you've taken up here. It can also be gathering and, like I say, looking into things more closely and you'll start to be able to make the decisions that's needed. You'll start to see that way forward and you'll progress when the time is right. So mentally, it's your perception of this that is really the key. It's the key. So if there's any setbacks here or you feel things are going slowly, accept it. Trust in the journey. Trust in the universe. You will start to see the way forward if you focus on what you've already built and not the time factor. If it's the time factor or things that have let you down, it'll be different for everybody. You have got the ability to get come out of this and see the way forward clearly. Make the right de decisions that are going to work for you. And you are going to achieve. You're going to find that emotional balance again. This, again, is a card of patience, and nobody likes to hear patience. Uh, you know, it's like, I don't, I'm not the most patient person. Rome wasn't built in a day, though, and I have to remind myself of that. This is you finding that emotional balance. You're creating beautiful things, so don't doubt your ability to do this. There's rebirth and rejuvenation from making these decisions, and you're going to flourish. You're definitely going to flourish. You have to go with it. You have to trust in the journey. And I know it can be very difficult if challenges come up and you feel that you're working really hard on something and it doesn't go your way. 
This could be pregnancy for some of you as well, so you might have to be patient over that. So patience is a virtue here, definitely, and I know it stinks. I know it does. But uh, you have got the ability to work through this, and you will work through this by focusing on what you've already achieved. You've achieved loads. Positive. Positive. Enjoy this positive time. Smile. Know that everything is going well. Where you're at is where you're meant to be. Protection. Protection. You're not alone. You are being looked after by your spirit guides and angels, always. So spirit hasn't forgotten about you. You've not been forgotten about. It's just at this moment in time, you're going to have to be a wee bit patient. You're going to have to, like I say, go back to the drawing board, look at the situation again, and you will get the clarity you need to move on. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.